Yo, what's the word? It's your boy 16. If you like the content on this channel, I want to ask you to like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to click that bell for post notifications. Also, I got a website at www.16shotonvisuals.com. But that's enough of me talking. Let's get to what y'all came to see. So, you know, it's a new artist that's uh, buzzing right now. And he kind of been going, like, real hard for Duck. And I, I never really seen him around too much like that. But I guess they had a relationship before he passed. And it's Fendi Boy. Like, how do you feel about him? <laughs> I, don't, I, don't. I think I think he said he was. Well, I, don't, I guess Big Cloud Records they don't got nothing to do with you, but like, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know no Big Cloud Records. I don't know Fendi Boys. Fendi Boy, that's his name, Fendi Boy. Yeah. No, nah, I don't know Fendi Boy. I heard, uh, I heard my father was saying like, hey, asking me questions like, who was him? I heard he did some motherfucker saying he know Duck and all that shit, but I never even heard the song. I didn't even look at the video. I don't know how he look. Yeah. So then, like, who who from FBG know him? Cause it seems like, cause he he going hard, like he dissing the fuck out of everybody, and it's like it's for somebody to do that. It seems like they got some type of emotional connection to to Duck to where they they knew him. Like, is that somebody you could say like knew Duck and was homies and shit like that? Personally, I don't think nobody knew him. I don't know if Duck knew him, but I know I don't know. Him. No, I don't. I, don't know. I just where you say he from? Uh, he said Pakistan, but then I seen some people on the internet say like, "Don't say you from here." So I don't know if he just like lived there, but what? I don't know. Like I don't really know him personally. I thought I thought y'all knew him because the way he was no. going, you would think like. Yeah, no, I don't know. So do you do you fuck with what he doing? As far as like, I mean, we do his thing. We whatever he doing, do his thing. But he dissing motherfuckers and shit? Or he just like shouting out folks? He shouting out Duck and dissing everybody that he was in tour with. Or from from people that most of y'all don't just like. Or like like dissing dis like dis now. I like yeah. basically like portraying like he with us. Yeah, even dissing people like Fredo. Like I never seen you diss Fredo, but I seen right. him do shit like that. Like, I mean, if he... I mean, if you do his thing, if you, you better be with that shit, you better be with that shit, because that shit come with a lot of shit. You got here yeah. dissing people and saying you with this and saying you with, and with that and shit. Yeah, I had seen a lot with him and him and Driller, and I guess they used to have some type of relationship where he got the dissing them too. But what's the situation with, like, Young Money? Like, you still cool with Young Money? I don't know. I don't know what's going on. I only I ask because I seen... Your brother, you know, shouting them out. Y'all was in the video, so. Shout out who he shout out. He shout nah, out. Nah, I don't think he shout out them. I think he just like uh. Yeah, he said R.P. Melly. Yeah, Doodle. he just shout out to Melly. Like it's just it's Melly. You feel me? Yeah. Um, also, so a lot of people thinking it's, it's Young Money and it's, it's really just Melly. Nah, I don't think he like shout out shout out Young Money. Uh, it's Melly, like Melly. I forgot real love for Melly. But what what is the situation, Young Money? Because I noticed in one of the videos, one of uh, Duck last videos, he had he had dropped a while, and a lot of people thought like Duck and that was cool. Duck been dropping wise since his first video. Like, that shit been going on. That got nothing to do with. It. Yeah, nothing to do with that. But I don't know what I don't know what's going on. It's just confusing because. I don't know, maybe, I don't know, I'm tweaking, but it seemed like motherfuckers seen each, like, y'all on videos together and shit, like, as Who? far as... We're young men? Yeah. We in videos with them? Yeah, like, in the past, y'all ain't had no... Oh, yeah, we have videos, we was in videos See, with that's them. the part I'm confused about, like... You said, like, what happened with them? You thought yeah. he was cool? Yeah, because it seemed like, you said he been doing that since his first videos, but then you see them with videos together. Yeah, but them, them him dropping the wires ain't got nothing to do with that young money. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm saying. Oh, see, that's the part we confused about. I don't be knowing. I know it's two different young monies, but I only yeah. really know about. Yeah, one. that's some whole other shit. So, what you got as far as music? What, you working on like mixtapes, anything? Oh, I don't know. I've been just like been recording a lot of shit. I probably just on steady drop singles or something. I don't really own really too much steady drop no mixtapes i really think i probably like build up my uh my spotify catalog yeah shit like that work on that drop a couple uh, videos 
it seemed like you uh you kind of slowed down on, on dropping music and shit like that like was it because of death or duck or did you have other shit going on it'd be like real life situations and then like trying to trying to uh try to like fall back from other shit and like you know create my own sound shit like that and then if I still like the, the duck shit like I ain't wanna like at the duck situation like that shit like people doing like a lot of weird ass shit a lot of weird ass shit to either like with his name on it, it either try like, fake love ass shit, fake statuses, fake brother posts, fake I love you, I wish the all type of shit. I was there rooting for you, all type of lame ass shit. So I was just watching all that shit in the back. Like I ain't, I ain't really wanna do too much. I ain't wanna make no song about the shit, none of that shit. Like I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm gonna make a song or something for it, but it's gonna be like some. Right time and something that's perfect. For sure. So when you say people doing a lot of weird stuff, do you feel like people doing like things that you would consider like clout chasing and shit like that? It's it's past clout chasing, bro. It's shit weird as hell. Shit weird as hell for like. It's shit weird. Like it's some shit I want. I don't even be like. It's shit I want to say, but I don't want to really like say too much. Like, People be weird as hell. Motherfucker know damn well you want this man, brother. So it's basically like people, like now that he gone, he can't really speak up for himself as people acting like they was closer than what they was, shit like that. It's all type of shit. That's then the like, then the like, now that he gone, he can't say shit, then like a lot of people just saying all type of shit. Like, yeah. You feel me? So can you speak on like where were you when when he actually did die? Like were you out doing anything? Or? Me and Cass, we used to, me and Cass was working on the mixtape. I think we was probably doing like our third or fourth song. We was on our way to the studio. We was in the car and shit. I get the call. I forgot who called me. But I already had the call. Then my brother ended up calling me like, man, y'all check up on woo woo, they saying this and shit. So I was already in the in the midst of calling around but then I'm already got the doubt like it's duck motherfucker got all type of fake calls every other day saying a motherfucker shot duck or some shit he in the house yeah. or playing cards somewhere getting high some shit you hear me a studio or something so I'm thinking alright man motherfucker lying but I'm still checking on him at the same time I get the call and said it was official so we autom automatically just you know reroute hospital see what's going on so like, what was your reaction when you got the call? Like, cause I know it was a lot of confusion when it. No, like I said, like at first, it's like motherfucker always saying some dumb ass yeah. shit like that, cause it's duck for you hear me. So I'm like, all right, that's they probably lying. But when I first like, all right, he got shot. I'm like, all right, then he probably he'll be good. He make it to the hospital. Motherfucker big as hell. He finna eat the book. Yeah. You hear me? Shit fucked up though. I know you said when you first got the news, you ain't you know you ain't really believe it because there's always rumors and shit like that. Right. But once it was confirmed and you found out he passed, like how did you react? I mean, it ain't really hit me at first, but I don't know. It's like it was like it was still I was still like, I was like a shock. Like I said, like it ain't real because like yeah. before all like before me and Dutchie we even got our little notoriety or anything like he been like years before us he been had it so he been like been telling us like boy i ain't finna go in that gas station ooh like yeah. ooh, we gotta send motherfuckers in the gas station shit like that so he then knew how to move and shit like that so for him to even be where he was at or downtown or anything like this shit was a shock shit wasn't real like you feel me so that that's not something he'll normally do some even downtown I mean, like he 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 like he be outside, yeah. but far as like being outside waiting in line or, so, or however they say it was, no, yeah. he, he don't do that. You do you think he did it because it was downtown? Because you know downtown is a spot most people feel like you should be able to do that. No, he don't do that. This this duck. Yeah. Like, bro, he don't do none of that shit, bro. 
So is that why he was able to survive as long as he been out here? Cause he, you know, you know people been wanting to do something to him for a long, long time, like since y'all was kids. Okay. Like, I mean, like, but I, mean, I could say like he like folks still gonna shot. What he he still gonna go to them city sports and go to them little, them little regular uh, little JBs and all that. Like for, he be outside, he shot, but he just know how to move. Like he stick and move. You yeah. know better to be standing and wait, waiting in some spot too long. Like he know, like he know motherfucker with face expressions and everything. Like is you fucking with him or not type shit. Like he know all that shit. So how the whole scene played out, it wasn't real to me. So is that how you move too, like the same way? Yeah. So with something like that happening, does that make you want to leave Chicago sometime? Cause you know everybody always was saying asking Duck why he ain't leave and shit like that. Like you don't, you still don't want to. No, yeah, no. And what's your reason for wanting to stay in Chicago? Is it just because it's what you're used to? Nah, like, I ain't want to stay in Chicago. Like, I'm, I'm going to get up out this motherfucker. It's just like, that. I just don't want to leave because that reason. Yeah. You feel me? So, you know, before we close out, is there anything else you want to let people know, get off your chest, anything like that? Nah, really. I don't let my boy duck. I don't let Tuka, I don't let everybody else. FBG, you know, talk to me nice on Jesus Christ like you little boys don't know what's going on. On them gray, new music on the way. That's just like 80 ball too. Stupid. Mm, bro, let people know how to find you on social media. Young go dumb on Instagram. FBG Young on YouTube. All right, let's I know you can follow my uh my Spotify too. Cause I'm trying to lit that up, man. FBGM. Yeah. Let me know who got it with you for the interview. Sixteen shots, one motherfucking boy. All right, love, bro. Love, bro.